Hey, what's up? It's Bethel's Roll. Um, I know I haven't done anything in a little bit, but you know, sorry about that. It happens. Um, I just wanted to, I'm in the garage messing around and I wanted to kind of show what it is I do and what I use because I can't really go out and shop uh, a whole bunch, you know, and I can have things sent in, but it's just not worth it. So I go to Wally World. Bam! Freaking Pro Mix has worked out freaking great. Uh, you know, especially for me, since, you know, the whole watering thing can go a little quicker than I would like. And well, that, that, that peat and that mixture actually helps me a whole bunch and it really does um so that is the soil i have a bag of uh perlite over there that i just didn't bring in here with me but um diatomaceous earth goes in there i actually go and use um the um dr earth uh the homegrown and the tomato vegetable the 463 and then I use well that that's there in front of you you know but I use it as I know people are gonna kill me if anybody gets to hear this but I actually put I actually put um, a cup for every cubic foot so it's four cups um, three cups of the, or two cups of the diatomaceous earth, because that stuff goes a long way. Um, the oyster shell that, um, that I use for calcium, also I put maybe two cups, three cups, but everything else, gets, it's straight up four cups. You know, I put in a cup for every freaking cubic foot that I got in there, and then I let it sit, you know? I really do, I let it sit in there. Since I don't move so quick with the plants and I don't have very many at all, this soil can sit up in here for, I don't know, what, three months sometimes without ever getting used, four months without ever getting used. Like I can go an entire, like grow with only get, dipping into it. Yeah, two months later after it's been done, two months or so, three months. This this. I think that's the earliest is two months, but well, look, as far as getting this stuff to mixed up, I know people are like, man, there's no way, but every now and then I get to surprise people when they come out and they get to see me hanging over the side of my freaking wheelchair trying to trying to do this and it's just an easy process but one that takes me a whole freaking day just because I'm not always able to to get things the way I want See what I mean? Oh, getting up is a pain in the ass. Uh-oh.